Today we're going to talk about the gym skate versus the last one here. But first, let's go for a hike and jump three off. Doggos off leash in it. Oh, Bisbee just was chasing a bird. What was it, Bisbee? What was it? It's a bird. This is pretty.
Alaska versus Idaho, or as you like to say, the Gem State versus the Last Frontier. Pretty cool, pretty cool. Um, we wanted to make this not a video about everything we like about Idaho and don't like about Alaska. Yeah, when we sat down and started going over the differences, I was really surprised with what we came up with. I was too. Right, yes. yeah. Definitely a lot of similarities, but some right. huge, huge differences between the two. One of the biggest differences we've noticed living here is crime. Anchorage, right. especially living in Anchorage, has a very high rate of violent crime. It's pretty unfortunate. Here in Boise, <laughs> It's kind of the opposite right. versus Alaska, which also struggles with alcoholism and depression. So what do you say is probably the next big thing that you've noticed about living here versus Alaska? The taxes. Definitely taxes. Because here in Boise, we have the income tax and a sales tax. Right. Also too, the property taxes are much lower here in Idaho than they are in Alaska. Correct. I'd say the next big difference that I noticed too is it seems like there's definitely a lot more freedoms in Alaska. Yeah. I mean, living in Anchorage, you still had the municipality, but it wasn't near as strict as say like the city of Boise and like their policies with like say off leash or no dog areas and things like that. I mean, literally these guys are like fishing game officers of Alaska. Like they'll come popping out of trash cans for all you know, they can be anyone. <laughs> but it definitely felt that there was a lot more flexibility and overall general freedoms and their laws are definitely more modern. Like Idaho has a lot of absurd laws. Like if you Google strange laws in Idaho, you will come up like there's an absolute rabbit hole of random things about like what, giving your spouse too much chocolate. <laughs> um, you know, there's a nipple law. There's all kinds of random weird laws here in Idaho that are definitely not the case in Alaska. Alaska has two seasons, winter and construction season. Construction <laughs> season might only last a few months and it could rain for most of that, so you never know. Versus here in Idaho, we do have a full four seasons. The wages. Wages, yeah. Definitely here in Idaho. Average. Minimum wage. So the wages definitely pay better in Alaska. But the cost of living definitely offsets that. No doubt. The heavily populated areas in Alaska seem to have a lot of trash and such in the digits. And it seems like you'll see people even just dumping trash in right. the most random of places and I definitely have not noticed that as much here in Idaho. No, um, Boise really keeps it. Idaho likes to keep it clean. Right. It's astounding the amount of homeless people that are in Anchorage. Um, a lot of them come from rural like pioneer lifestyles so living in a city with infrastructures and soup kitchens and shelters and things like that um, can definitely accommodate them differently than the average homeless person. It's a very challenging place to be homeless with nine right. months of winter. What frustrated you about going to the grocery store in Alaska? Having to pay Alaska prices for half rotten food. Definitely. I remember you would get so frustrated. You'd be like grabbing things off the shelves going, what is this? This is half rotten. Versus right. here in Idaho, we're literally like, as you may have saw in our last video, farm to table. Right. Exactly. A lot fresher. I find Idaho to be much more accessible for me than Alaska. Now, if you're living in Alaska and you have your own plane and boats and, you know, fly in remote lodges, that's a whole different thing. That's the Alaska dream, no right. doubt. I mean, if you can have the Four lake... wheelers ATVs. Yeah, and a Lake Eliamna Lodge, and you're only in Anchorage mm -hmm. to do Costco runs, two thumbs up on right. that one. For the average person living in Anchorage, any place you can go, so can anybody else. And there's right. three roads. And, you know, once you've been down those three roads, you've kind of seen it all, done it all. Here in Idaho, we have a lot of public lands, like BLM lands. Um, we do have state parks like Alaska. Alaska has state parks, but your accessibility to the state parks in Alaska, I feel, is very, very limited. One of the biggest differences we noticed moving here was definitely the diversity, right? Right, right the yeah. diversity, yeah. Alaska to here. Alaska, especially Anchorage, is an incredibly diverse city. It is. And the benefit to that is the restaurants. One of the most flavorful restaurant scenes Yes, like, I you, miss that so very much. Yeah, okay. Anchorage has amazing restaurants. Yes, and we miss them. amazing. We do miss you, Anchorage restaurants. Mm -hmm. Another big difference is I felt like living in Alaska, you're especially the Anchorage, Kenai, Seward, all that Gulf. You've got the salmon. You've got the, the ocean. Bit, yeah, the crab fishing. Ocean is a big part of your life in Alaska. Right. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So I feel like in terms of rivers and lakes, Idaho and Alaska are really on par with each other, but Alaska does one up it with the ocean. Right, yeah. And the white fish and all that. I miss so. the helmet. Yeah. And the so crab. There again. <laughs> I mean, 
we could get it here, but it's not fresh. It's not the same. Yeah. You know, it's, and it's right, not all the same. Right. And like, so another yeah. thing I like here about Idaho is the trees. Oh, There's the trees. such a diversity of trees. Where in Alaska you just have the spruce and the birch, and so the, and the cottonwoods <laughs> and the cottonwoods, right? Right, right. Yeah, so there's pretty much three trees and the yeah. willows. So four. Right. Which and willows? Do they count yeah. as a tree? I don't know. It's really more of a bush. Alaska will pay you a permanent fund dividend to live there. That's right. Alaska will pay you to live there. There's a PFD. That's a big plus for Alaska. Like no other state has that. So that's right. huge bragging rights. So good job, Alaska. <laughs> so hey, how about our utilities? I can combine our utility bills here, but it was only like one bill in Alaska. So you mean all our utilities combined here is equivalent to like the electric bill we paid in Anchorage? Correct. And we did not have a big place. It was a small two-bedroom right. apartment. And of course the capital, like we showed you in our previous videos, yeah. we had accessibility to our representatives in our capital, where in Alaska it's in Juneau and you can't get there unless you got the means and ways to fly there. So the conclusion to the Gen State versus the Last Frontier from what we've talked about, I guess, is just your lifestyle. It really is. It comes down to the individual person and what right. they like and what they want to get out of where they live. Right, exactly. Yeah, it really we is. We were just looking for a change in our lives to the lower 48 where you can actually go places and do things where you're so secluded in Alaska. But after doing this video, there's many things we love about Alaska and miss about Alaska and many things that we love here. Right. So, yeah, it really blew my mind that we went through that. Yeah, I was really surprised at how much um, we like about Alaska. Right, right. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. To all you in Alaska, we love you. Yeah, love everybody. <laughs> and we thank you all for your support and thank everybody helping to grow our new channel if you guys have any ideas or suggestions that you'd like to see us do for videos please let us know in the comments down below yeah that'd yeah. be great yeah make sure to like and subscribe we're going to be doing our best to create new content weekly we're working hard to come up with new things to share with you on a weekly basis and thanks for joining us thanks for joining us have a great day bye if one, two, three. If, if you, you like, like this video, video make sure, sure you, you give, give us, us a like <laughs> down below Okay, ready? One, two, three. If you, if like, you like this, this video, video, make, make sure, sure to give us a like down, down below. Let's, I'll say yeah. the first part, you say the second part. If you like this video, make sure you give us a like.